Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to some more Skyrim. We left off clearing out this whole area and damn it, why did I have to autosave now? I should have done this before I started. Damn it! So we need to fast travel. And we're gonna travel all the way back to Riften to turn this in. This op this one right here is just an optional thing. We never needed to do that at all. So uh, hopefully it doesn't affect my ending reward just because I took a different path in. It's just like an optional. Hey, if you want to go here and avoid fighting, then do that. But that's nothing like, it shouldn't affect the rewards. It's not like... An optional objective just an optional path for you to do what you want to do so hopefully it doesn't affect the awards I don't think it would but it's still on my map I mean I could still go through it but it would just be it'll be pointless because all it does is just make the quest easier just an optional way to make the quest easier it wasn't like an objective type thing so anyways we're gonna head back to Riften and we're gonna go turn this into the thieves guild and look at this guy why why put earrings in your hair like that That's just weird I don't know that's not me that's not me at all Press open up. There we go. I'm gonna go in here, turn this in, and then probably get another quest from him, obviously. There's no way we're done with the Thieves Guild yet, unless it's like uh, the Oblivion where it's like, no, no, no. No more quests until you fence uh, so much gold and items, which I don't think they do it in, uh, in this game. But I could be wrong. I have yet to see it, but perhaps they don't. Let's go ahead and talk to this guy real fast. He should be very happy with my my stuff. Yeah, my stuff. That's what I'm gonna call it. You've made a mess of things, and Maven's furious. I told you not to burn more than three of the hives. Oh, you didn't say I not more than three. Over with her for now, but you can forget your cut. Oh shit! I didn't know it was more than three. I thought it was just. Damn it! I burned all of them. I was trying to do more work and. I fucked up. I gotta listen to details better. It wasn't in my quest list. It just said burn three out of three. It didn't say burn. It didn't say you can't burn more. You just had to at least burn three. I thought, okay, my bad. It should say burn three out of five of the things or something. So I would have known. Damn it. At least you remembered one of the things I asked. Let me see that. Arangoth sold Golden Glow? What's that idiot thinking? He has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of a deal. But I'm certain he'll find out. If only the parchment had the buyer's name instead of this odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? Blast. Well, I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. But for now, you're off to speak to Maven Blackbriar. She asked for you by name. Don't sound so eager. It's not a social visit. It's business. That's between you and Maven, and I prefer to keep it that way. Just keep your ears open and your mouth shut, and you'll do fine. Nice, so completed loud and clear, and it's probably gonna start another one. Can we talk to him about anything Maven else? No. Right Let's go ahead and see if we can talk to anyone. Let's talk for him. You're kind of cute. Don't you have better things to? This better be important. Than to. Let's see if there's anyone here I can sell stuff to. Talk to me. Okay. I think you're all right. There's someone I just don't remember. I think it's a Vex. Look, if I was a little harsh before, I just want you to know it's because you were new. Know what I mean? Look, I don't really know you. I don't even really know anyone here. Why do you care anyway? It's not like we're family. This is a business. Look, you want to know about me? All right, I'll tell you. I'll tell you about the time I was a young girl, barely out of her teens, living on a pig farm in the middle of nowhere. Didn't have a coin to spend between our entire family. Ate the same slop we fed our livestock. Oh wait, it gets much better. How about the fact that our farm was attacked by bandits, and that they killed my entire family who didn't even brandish a weapon against them? Here's the best part. They took me as a prize and violated me for a fortnight. Tossed me from bandit to bandit like... like... It's fine. I had to tell someone, I suppose. Carrying around a weight like that, it hurts after a while. Cuts you inside like a dagger to the heart. Over time, I managed to gain their confidence. Then one night, I grabbed a knife, waited until they fell asleep, and cut their throats. I never returned to that pig farm, you know. There's nothing for me there. So that's my sad story. What do you think? Maybe one day. Just not today. Alright, well, it was worth a try. We've already tried talking to you. Yes? Rune, we've, I guess we talked to you. I don't remember talking to Rune before. And this is gonna be. 
Yeah, I guess uh, yeah, so. we already tried talking to him. Yes. If you want to be a master, we can tra we can train with him, but I'm not gonna do that. What's on your mind? Can train at archery or archery with him? I'm sorry, archery. Excuse me. Um, that's just a practice. All right, let's just leave. I think you can sell stuff to Vex, but I really don't want to go through no loading screen just to find Vex. So let's just get out of here. We'll do that later. We'll train with her later. Not train with her, but uh, trade with her later. Excuse me. So open a rift in. Gotta get out of rift in. See where this next quest takes us. And they probably do some other stuff that's local. That's uh, not necessarily local, but stuff that's that I put on, but it's kind of far away. But yet we've been there before, so I can just go there and revisit it. Something like that. So we're gonna see in a second once we get out of here, of course. Bum 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 bum. I also might visit White Run just so I can see if we, that's where we need to get the Dragonborn quest started. At. I I do have the Dragonborn DLC, but for some reason I do not. Uh, it has not started at any in any ways. I don't think. So let me take a look at this map. Do we have this quest on? That's the first thing. We need to speak to Maven. Where's Maven at? Good fucking question. I have no clue. Probably at her house. That's right up here. But uh, no, maybe she's not there. Maybe she's at home. So that's my current location. All right. So that's where we need to speak to her at. All right. We'll do that in a second. Uh, 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 um, what else? And then we'll probably do some stuff like we can probably go to Solitude and do those three things there. Probably go to Winterhold, do that, and probably yeah, maybe we'll visit that. But maybe go over here since we discovered this area and uh, see what the vampires are seeking over there and continue on the Dawn Guard DLC a little bit. Anyways, for now, let's go ahead and find Maven Blackbriar. She's probably pissed at us because I stole her horse. One thing I did. Second thing I did was uh, was I burned three of the hives instead of only I mean I burned five of the hives instead of only three. I think it was five, either five or a little less. The bee in the bar. This is where she's gonna be. Did not know that, but apparently she likes to hang out here. Maybe this is just for a social visit. This isn't really where she likes to come. This is just some place to talk to us, and that's in public in case in case I decided to kill her. Nah, I'm just kidding. Where is Maven at? People of Riften, heed my words. The return of the dragons is not mere coincidence. Blessings of Mara. This is one of the signs. The signs that Lady Mara is displeased with your constant inebriation. May you return to her benevolence. Alright, let's go ahead and sit down and talk to Maven. No, no, Mara. We talked about this. Talon. So you're the one that burned down Golden Glow Estate. Do you have any idea what that little stunt you pulled is going to cost me? I'm amazed you even bothered to show your face here. The only reason we're having this conversation is due to Brynjolf's assurance you won't botch another assignment. He claims you possess some sort of uncanny aptitude for your line of work. Quite frankly, I find that hard to believe. Is that confidence I hear? Or is it arrogance? Strange how often they're confused. You have to understand. It's been a long time since Brynjolf sent me anyone I can rely on. Faith. I don't have faith in anyone. All I care about is cause and effect. Did the job get done and was it done correctly? There's no gray area. I hope not. This is an important job. I have a competitor called Hunting Brumidary that I want to put out of business. I also want to know how they managed to get the place up and running so quickly. Head to the Bannered Mare in Whiterun and look for Malus Machius. He'll fill you in on all the details. The Blackbriar family has always been allied with the Guild. Our connections with the Empire and within Skyrim make for a perfect fit. I dare say the guild owes its survival as much to my family as it does to its own people. Some layabout named Sabion. Been a thorn in my side for the last few years now. Not a day goes by that I don't regret letting Sabion get as far as he did. In only a few short years, he's taken that bile he calls mead to market and a chunk of my profits with it. 
I can't imagine where he found the gold to take it to market so quickly. Exactly. With Savion in prison, his meadery will be forced to close. Then I swoop in and take over the place. No more competition. The Golden Glow estate job has undoubtedly interrupted the supply of honey I need to make my mead. Savion could use this interruption to his advantage and collect a larger share of the market. I can't have that. And that is about it. One more time, in case I wasn't clear. You butcher this job, and you will be sorry. Alright, yes ma'am. Let's go ahead and leave this area. Shouldn't you be on your way to work? I'm leaving right now, bitch. Hey, who are you? You have some nerve coming back here after what you did to Kirava. <laughs> what did I do to Kirava? I don't even fucking know. <laughs> I think we talked to everyone in here, but Sorry, let's just double check. Why hire a common soldier to currently even have a master of the army? A dread never forgets a traitor. You'll pay for this. Why am I why is everyone hating me? What did I do? Absolutely. Did you still want to buy one? Safe try. Yeah, what do you want? If this is about the meadery, we can talk later. What did I do that everyone hates me? If you've got the coin, you're welcome here. Something Otherwise, to her. What did I do to you? Oh no what I threatened her, I believe. <laughs> I I pulled some kind of threat. No okay, let's go ahead and leave. They're not they don't like me in this bee in the barb. <laughs> I don't even know what I did. I wish there was an option. It's like, what did I do? Like, you know, just to fill me in. Like, I have no clue. What did I do to you, huh? Why do you hate me? What is it that I've done? So we need to go to White Run. We're not gonna do that yet, but although we do, we will be going there soon. Let's make sure there's no place close to us that we've been. Okay, now all these places are undiscovered. Let's go to Solitude. There's three things to do here. So let's go to Solitude. Uh, not Solitude, but uh, Windhelm. Excuse me. I, I think I've been calling Solitude multiple times. Even before this point, I was saying, oh, we can go to Solitude, we can go to Winterhold, we can go to White Run. I think I, I didn't mean Solitude, I meant Windhelm. My fucking home. I like Solitude, but it's ran by Imperial Legion assholes. So, no, I like Windhelm a lot better. So that's why I'm embarrassed to call this place Solitude. Although, Solitude is a nicer, nicer village, but the people that run it are assholes. At least the Yarrow is. <laughs> Alright, so we have three things to do here. Now, that's going to lead us out. We have a couple over here. One is actually, I believe, is going to be joining the Dark Brotherhood. Ooh, this is going to be cool. Oh, ew. I've never done this before, ever. Nor have I ever seen any videos, nor have I know anything about this. All I know about the Dark Brotherhood is what I've done in... Um, Oblivion. That's all I know about the Dark Brother. Let's go and tell this kid that we killed him. Well, Grohog the Kind. Is she, you know? Aha! I knew you could do it. I just knew it. I knew the Dark Brotherhood would save me. Here, just like I promised. This should fetch you a nice price. Uh, thank you. Thank you again. All right, so there we go. We completed Innocence's lo or Innocence Lost. Uh, do we have anything else? We have some family, uh, some something from the family. I don't fucking know. I didn't read it. Yet. So we completed that. So we should probably should get talked to about the actual Dark Brotherhood soon. If not, I'll have to figure out when we can join that. But I believe probably the next time we sleep, we're probably gonna get talked to. I would just assume. So, anyways, let's go ahead and do the other things that are here. I don't think another. I think that's it. Yeah, it said completed. So never mind. I don't even need a look. So it looks like we have two more things to do here, and this place is kind of, kind of in the wrong area to be doing anything. We need to get all the way to the side of the house, or the side of the, of the house, of the, of the city, yeah, or town, whatever you want to call it. Either one. I'm not sparing any coins for you assholes. Hold it there. Keep your distance. Another girl killed. This is Susanna, from Candlehearth Hall. Served me a drink just a few nights ago, but I can't say I knew her. Susanna's the third. It's always the same. Young 